Gucci? To accept cryptocurrency? That's the word circulating across the internet. Just sit tight. <laughs> it's your girl Kelly Crypto. What's up? Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Kelly Crypto and today is Thursday, May 5th. I hope everyone out there is doing well, doing good. I'm well rested so I'm feeling great this morning. Now with that being said, I want to go ahead and jump into this story. So like I mentioned before, it has been announced that Gucci will be accepting cryptocurrency. All right, so let's go ahead and hop right on into this article. So Gucci to start accepting crypto payments in some U.S. stores. So not all U.S. stores, but some. Now quick takeaways they have listed. Italian brand joins Philip Plyne in taking Bitcoin payments, and luxury brands are exploring strategies for Metaverse Web3. Gucci will accept payments and cryptocurrencies in the US starting this month, as the luxury industry takes tentative steps into the digital asset universe. Customers in some stores in New York, Los Angeles, Miami, Atlanta, and Las Vegas will be able to pay using digital tokens from the end of May, the Italian fashion house said in a statement. It will adopt this payment option through its North American stores this summer. So actually really soon. Uh, Gucci, owned by Caring SA, will initially accept 10 cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, ETH, Dogecoin, and Shiba Inu. The company joins fashion designer Philip Pline, whose online store started accepting crypto payments in 2021. Pline said in an interview in late April that he expects purchases made with digital tokens to surge this year, and that accepting cryptocurrencies has gained his company a lot of new clients in the crypto community. Caring Chief Executive Officer Francois Henry Penault in February says Gucci and other fashion houses like Balenciaga had innovation teams looking at opportunities related to the metaverse and Web3. Versions of the internet built around blockchain technology, cryptocurrencies, and non-fungible tokens. We're at a very precarious stage of what may happen. Nothing is certain, Penault said at the time. The approach taken by Caring and its brands is more test and learn than wait and see, he said, adding that crypto payments have very heavy legal and fiscal implications. The decision to embrace crypto payments shows how luxury brands are trying to appeal to younger generations of consumers by catering to emerging trends, such as creating outfits for digital characters. But not all luxury groups are convinced. Axel Dumas, the executive chairman of Hermes, warned earlier this year of the risk of hype around the metaverse, saying it could be a way to make easy money. Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies started rallying in 2020 and into last year as central banks and governments unleash unprecedented stimulus into COVID-ravaged communities. The bull market came to an abrupt end in November as soaring inflation forced central banks to take a more hawkish stance. Bitcoin is more than 40% off its peak, and many smaller tokens have suffered even steeper declines. Among notable crypto skeptics are investment legend Warren Buffett and his longtime business partner Charlie Munger, who last week reiterated their disdain for assets like Bitcoin. Gucci generated more than half of Karen's revenue in the first quarter of this year. The fashion house has recently been hit by lockdowns in China, where the government has battled to contain a resurgence of C-19. Okay, so another day and another crypto story that we're really not too shocked to hear about, right? Like I said in previous videos, this is going to continue to happen because this is the new way. This is how things are going. Okay, so for all my fashion lovers, for all my Gucci lovers, how do y'all feel about this? Drop a comment down below, letting me know. If you haven't done so already, be sure to go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you enjoy watching content similar to this. I look forward to catching you guys on my next video. Talk to y'all later. <laughs>